hello hello guys welcome back to the channel Igbe here hope you're having a fantastic day before I get started on today's video I just want to give a quick shout out to all my subscribers we hit the 1000 subscribers this week I am very excited I am grateful I appreciate every single one of you you make doing this worthwhile and I really appreciate you guys being here so let's get to today's video so we are going to be exploring United Health we have a total of six roles in this video so guys stick with me as we go through one of them at a time the first three are non phone roles and the last three are phone roles okay so the first three you would not be required to be on the phone and the last three would require you to be on the phone so the first one is clinical admin coordinator so this is a fully remote role as you can see it says right here you can telecommute from anywhere within the US okay and as far as what's required for this role high school diploma or higher two years of customer service experience analyzing and solving customer problems that's what's required for this okay then salary is starting $16 minimum and a maximum $31.44 per hour depending on where you live all right let's move on the second position is titled quality audit representative so this is also a fully remote role that you can work anywhere within the US and it says it right here okay so what's expected for this position they do have like some information here about 40 hours are required to have flexibility to work any of our eight hour shift schedule so which means you can work the typical nine to five or you can also be chosen to work other types of shifts for this position what's required high school diploma or GED one plus years of individual health insurance claims experience one year of experience working with quality assurance in general so just healthcare health insurance experience is what you're looking for and if you have information as far as different plans go HMO versus PPO and so forth so if you've worked for health insurance company in the past these should be easy to have in your resume because you would have already covered HMOs PPOs Medicaid and so forth okay and then talks about Excel you know filtering spreadsheets pivot tables and so forth okay and this the salary bracket for this is very similar to the first $16 starting and up to $31.44 per hour depending on where you live let's move on the third one is also titled clinical administrative coordinator this is specifically for the state of Ohio though okay so again clinical administrative coordinator but they are asking for you to live in Youngstown, Ohio for this position. And it says you right here again, flexibility to work anywhere within Youngstown, Warren or Salem, Ohio. And then in terms of what's required for this role, high school diploma, but they're saying that if you don't have high school diploma, you should have two years equivalent experience working in healthcare industry, two years of customer service, one year of experience in a healthcare setting, office setting using the telephone or computer and then you know the experience with Microsoft Word Excel Outlook and so forth so the salary for this role is similar to the first one which is between $16 and $31 that's the third role okay these three roles are non phone jobs now we're gonna move on to the phone jobs the first phone jobs we're gonna be talking about is inbound clinical administrative coordinator and this position there is a 1000 sign on bonus and it's a fully remote role because you can telecommute from anywhere within the US okay for this position it's not state specific they also are offering paid training for this position it says it right here we offer two weeks of paid training okay central time zone that's something to keep in mind they can pick any eight hour shift schedule 
during normal business hours. So which means the typical nine to five or even later start time. So you have that option. Just keep that in mind. And training is virtual. So you don't necessarily need to go in physically. This is all virtual. Everything about this position is virtual. So high school diploma is required, one year experience in health insurance, one year of taking calls in high volume call center environment. Okay. And then the salary is the same as the first three. So $16 starting $31 and 44 cents maximum, depending on where you live. Okay. And then the next role that is also telephonic is customer service representative. This is a fully remote role, as you can see right here. As long as you reside in any of the states in the US, you can work this job, okay? This is a full-time position. Training is also going to be provided for this position and it will be virtual as well. Then what's required? High school diploma or GED, one year of experience in customer service okay, or call center, and the ability to work shifts between 8 a.m. and 5 p.m. And then they are asking for you to be familiar with Microsoft Office applications. Okay. Salary for this one is $16 starting and up to $27.31 per hour. So again, depending on where you live, that's what you can expect in terms of salary. And then the last role, there is a sign on bonus with this role as well. So patient account representative insurance follow up. This is a remote role as well. It's fully remote anywhere within the U S okay. There is a sign on bonus of $2,000 for this position. It's a full time role. So 40 hours per week. And then what's required high school diploma, basic proficiency with windows applications and Microsoft office applications, six months exposure to acquiring and managing data to support a project. And then one year experience of customer service experience with Epic. Okay. So this position, by the way, guys, it's also, it looks like more of a hybrid role. It can be a full da data entry type of role where you don't necessarily need to be on the phone. And it could also be you being on the phone because you are going to be following up with premium collections, making sure that customers have paid their different pr premiums. If they have not paid, if they have overdue bills, you would be making different calls to ensure that you recover such payments. So this position is a mixed type of role between being on the phone and not being on the phone. So it is both for this last position. Okay. And the salary for this position is $16 and up to $27 and 31 cents per hour. Again, depending on where you live. Okay. So those are the six roles I have for you guys from United health. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel. If you have not subscribed already, turn your notification bell on. So you get notified when I do post new videos. Again, I want to thank you so much for watching this video till next time. Best of luck to you guys. Take care. Bye-bye.